What is up everybody? Welcome back to the Accelerations Hub for another video. So today we have another two part video. It's gonna be the first part. I'm gonna be showing you guys what I got in the mail over the weekend that is Accelerations related. And then the second part is gonna be another pack opening. So the second part will have the second of the four part pack opening where I was opening 55 booster packs. So without further ado, let's get into what we got in the mail. So first things first, I had purchased a lot of 35 Accelerations cards with two foils for $53. Uh, they look like they were in good condition. That's probably the biggest risk that I pull on my uh, eBay page is buying stuff that looks like it's in good condition. I've been burned several times where I purchased already opened accelerators cards and then they turn out to be damaged and I can lose a lot of money that way. But the cards looked almost perfect to me in the images. So uh, I went ahead and paid $53. I'm assuming two foils, uh, it's 20 bucks a piece, so 40 and then I just have to make like 13 bucks back on the 35 cards, which is normally pretty easy at a dollar per card at least. So uh, I figured this could be a good 20 to $40 um, purchase for me as far as profits go, just depending on the condition of the cards. So let's rip this package open and see what condition the cards are in. So first the big ticket items, a foil torque spine buster and a foil strato thruster. And I can confirm these are in near mint to mint condition, which is awesome. That's probably a good 40 bucks right there. So that's probably gonna make this purchase worth it. Uh, it's always risky buying foils that you don't know the condition on. So after reviewing the rest of the cards, I can confirm that he was correct in saying they're in near mint to make condition. These cards all look fantastic. Uh, so I definitely think I'm gonna end up making 30 to 40 bucks on this purchase. Um, it's taking a bit of a chance. It probably wasn't worth the risk. I was thinking about it after I bought it, but it worked out because this guy did correctly state the condition of his cards. So big shout out to that guy. So let's move on to the next package. Now this is something I think you guys will like. Um, you guys know it comes in the big priority boxes. These are sealed acceleracers. So we got in seven sealed acceleracers, some cool ones too. We got Excelium, Metalloid, RDO6, a Hollowback, two of these Ratifieds, I'm only gonna show one, and a Jackhammer. So this was a pretty good purchase. I got the seven of these for a total of $70. Uh, they were in two different lots, and I gotta go on a quick tangent. People that list items that have eight dollars so one lot was selling for like 20 bucks and eight dollars shipping the other one was like 15 bucks and eight dollars shipping and when i won both lots he would not combine the shipping so i ended up paying like 16 to 18 dollars in shipping but then he shipped them in the same package that's one of my biggest pet peeves you shouldn't be out there trying to make money off of the shipping costs because the price i should have paid was closer to 60 bucks but it ended up being a full 71 or 72 dollars still a good deal got it for about 10 bucks a piece so i'm not going to fret too much about it but uh, guys, if you're selling on eBay, try not to rip your buyers on shipping. But that's what we got in today in the mail. These beautiful seven sealed acceleracers. I uh, haven't decided yet if I'm gonna rip them open or not. If you guys think I should rip them open, go down in the comments and let me know. And if you want me to open them up, I'll do it in the next video. So let me know. And now we are going to switch over to the pack opening for the second half of the video. What is up guys? Welcome back to the Acceleracers Hub again. This is the second part of four pack openings on these 55 different Accelerators three packs. Uh, I just opened the first 10 a second ago and it was not pretty. We pulled a micro realm and that was it basically. So for this set of 10 packs, hopefully we can pull at least two foils to make up for all the bad luck we've had so far, right? So without further ado, let's get into it. Pack one. Drifting. Downshift. Power Rage. Gosh, I don't know what it is. This has been tough today. I think there was one time before that I opened 90 packs and I pulled a bunch of foils, probably like 10 or 11 foils out of it. So I don't know what's taking so long here. The Solar Realm, Choke Valves, and RDO3. Rock Slide, Nightlife, RDO3 again, but we'll see. Frictionless again. Magnesium. Gosh, I'm pulling some terrible cards. And RDO3. I keep pulling Magnesium and Nightlife. But there's always room for it to turn around. Here we go. Anti-gravitation. Nice pull. Folding corners. That's a nice pull. And RDO2. Cliffside realm. Choke valves. Rolling Thunder. All right. Total Traction. Stone Colossus, that's a good card. That's about a $5 hazard card. It's, it's 
It's pretty rare. And metalloid. All right, we have three packs to go in this part of the video. I was hoping this one would be better than the first one. It's kind of cool though, you guys can see me lose a lot of money on camera <laughs> and know that you guys were able to avoid it. Warped Round, that's a good $5 pull. Moscarillas again. Mm. And Power Bomb. Big Trouble. Torqued Riveted. RDO4. Let's get into the last pack for today's video. Reaction time, come on, give me one. Hyper high voltage, baseline. Wow, tough luck. Not only did we not pull a single foil, but we didn't pull a single card that's worth more than maybe four or five dollars at the absolute most. But that's all I have for this video, guys. Uh, stay tuned, coming soon, probably later this week or early next week, I will have the third part of the video and then obviously the fourth one will be coming after that if you guys still are liking these three pack opening videos by then. So I will see you guys in the next video. Be sure to smash the like and subscribe button for more Acceleracers content. Thanks guys.